<laughs> now, now, relax. This place is a lot less intimidating when you realize that you're the one who's causing all the commotion. What do I mean? Oh dear. You do realize how much you're about to earn, right? The importance of your upcoming examination? Now that you've been confirmed by me to take part in the attorney and clinician trials, you're the talk of the town. It isn't often that someone passes the rigorous training and study that your program provides, especially when I'm your handler. I don't acknowledge or address it often, but I am amongst the most strict teachers when it comes to sending my interns off to do the trials. It's not a matter of pride, but of principle. Our clients and patients deserve only the best, so I only send the best of the best for these examinations. <laughs> no, you're the first in years. It's a lengthy process to even apply for the examinations, but due to my successful record, I was able to get us a spot. And when a doctor puts forth an applicant to the exams, it's almost always guaranteed to be a success, resulting in a new doctor receiving their certification. <laughs> I know that it's all quite intimidating, but believe me when I tell you that you are bound to succeed. You've been training for years under my tutelage and know exactly what must be done when it comes to the examination. Gruesome work at times, yes, but you haven't failed me once, and I know that you won't fail when the real thing comes around. Call it intuition, but I have nothing but confidence in you. <laughs> exactly. It's why we're celebrating your victory ahead of time. I know that you will succeed in the coming examination. There's zero doubt. Just remember, it all comes down to your mental fortitude. You have the strength, the training, and the drive to do what must be done. Now it only comes down to having the mental strength to complete your task, whatever that may be. I wish that I could tell you what would be on the exam, but even I am not made privy to what it'll hold until the time comes. But that's why I trained you in everything. You are my best student. My number one. And that doesn't just go for this batch of trainees, but in general. For all time, I've never had more confidence in someone than you. It's why we're here, floating in space in one of the most expensive orbital restaurants where we can look down onto the planet from so far away and gaze out into the stars. The place where our dreams will take us. Where your training will take you. The galaxy is at your fingertips when you set your mind to it. And I am positive that you'll succeed. <laughs> Do you mind if I comment on something? You just... <laughs> you look amazing. I see you pulled out all the stops to dress up for the evening. Look, I completely understand. Comfort is an important part of dressing up for any occasion. <laughs> Would it surprise you to know I don't wear anything under my uniform while I'm at work? Look. You can judge me all you like, but as cold as it gets in the medical wing, I still find myself heating up due to all the stress, strain, and movement I go through. I just run hot naturally, like a furnace. I can outlast approximate winter, I swear. And why the suit? Because it's your special night. I know that you haven't technically earned your doctorate yet, but with the confidence I have in you, I'm sure that the coming examination will be a success in your favor. 
be the best I've ever had. And frankly, probably will ever have. No one has shown your commitment and passion for helping others. And I am doubtful that anyone that I mentor after you've received your certification will come even close to the qualities that you possess. But that's enough talk of work. Your success is sealed, and we're here to celebrate. Me? <laughs> I promise I'm more than comfortable in this suit. I had it tailored for me on Asteris Prime, one of the last places in this quadrant that still makes suits by hand. I... <laughs> never mind. Oh, if the night goes well, I think that perhaps you'll see more of me later. The suit, at least. Don't pay any mind to that. Tonight is going to be exciting. Look around you. The stratospire. The ambiance, the lighting, the atmosphere. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> Looking out these wide windows, you can see everything from up here. It all feels so... distant. So far. It's dreamlike. And soon, we'll be having ourselves a full course prepared by some of the finest Deternian chefs hired from planets across the Empire. I wish I could tell you what we're having. The menu changes day by day so that patrons can celebrate a completely unique experience every time. Not that I come here often enough to experience the same thing twice regardless. There will be some staples that will be part of our dining experience tonight and plenty of good drinks. But I'm more than certain that you'll enjoy them all. I've only been here a handful of times in the past myself and it was only to celebrate the accomplishments of my students. But, uh, you know, for the first time, I feel as if I'm coming here with more than a student. A colleague. I feel like I'm sitting here with a partner. One that I'd very much like to see more of in the future. The wording and its meaning is up for you to decide. <laughs> While we're dining, there'll be a live performance on the stage over there. Hmm. See the little indentations on the corners of that floor there? It's actually a platform. And when it rises, some of your fellow diners here will stand and move to play their music for us. What genre it is, no one ever knows. But it's always phenomenal. The Stratospire always prides itself on being exclusive and secretive. You know, it's one of the many reasons that I wanted to take you here ahead of your examination. <laughs> Think about it. If you and I were to celebrate when everyone else had finished their exams, then it'd be so crowded. And there'd be distractions from other doctors and their pupils. I wanted something special, something private, for just the two of us, and that's why it's so quiet here. I cannot stress how exclusive this place is. On occasion, even attorney and officials and military personnel can't find seating here. My good word and continued patronage got us these seats, as well as your stellar grades. <laughs> Your work speaks for itself. It's why we're here in the first place. Ah, it would appear that the first courses are beginning to arrive. The lights are dimming and soon it'll only be proximate frost blossoms that light our tables. That is not to mention the stars out there. You know, I must say... <laughs> You look beautiful tonight. Especially beautiful. <laughs> tonight is a night for the both of us. 
Let's toss caution and professionalism to the wayside. We both deserve this time to ourselves. Tireless work and results warrants relaxation and rest. And there's few that I think deserve rest as much as you. I truly do mean that. When I see you, I see so much possibility. And so much that... So much to love. But we'll discuss this later. Looks like the show is just about to start. <laughs> Enjoy your meal. It smells amazing, doesn't it? Um, hey. Excuse me. Yes, it's nothing important. But... I just wanted to bring to your attention that... Since I knew that we'd be off-world for this, I rented out a nice, cozy little place downtown. Mm -hmm. Downtown El Teresa. One of the best sights this side of the galaxy can offer. I figured I'd be drinking and I didn't want to take a shuttle while inebriated. Especially not with the distance it is to return to the ESP-7 station. <laughs> Well, it's a beautiful place, don't get me wrong, but it's only got the one bad. But I was wondering if maybe, maybe you'd like to join me. It's no joke. If you'd have me, I'd love to have you. I promise that the view will be unlike anything you've seen before. And I'll see to it personally that you're left satisfied with your time with me. Besides, I'm sure that after tonight, you and I could both use a good shower and some relaxation. As comfortable and private as the space here at the Stratospire is, I believe that perhaps you and I could do for some time to... ourselves. I know that we spend plenty of time alone at the office, but... this would be different. You and I, completely alone, a place to ourselves, a gorgeous view, comfortable sheets, the highest quality of living, we'd have it all, just for a night. What do you say? Would you like to accompany me, sweetheart? <laughs> I'm glad to hear it. Looks like the show is just about to end. Perfect timing. What do you say that you and I get a move on? I've got a few things that I'd like to show you. <laughs>